Hi, this is Kushbu. I tell you one thing. Look, after your exam, somebody asks for your exam. So let's suppose your friend is asking you, who has scored 90 on 100 and you scored 45. So you can give a tricky answer that I scored 2 marks less than half of your marks. So then, so much maybe what I can try. So this type of questions we are going to do here. So this is basically the word problem from exercise 3.3 of your NCRT book. It says, find the solution using substitution method. After the first substitution method I use karke, it's the solution method. The difference between two numbers is 26 and one number is 3 times the other. Two numbers go subtract karke by 26 and one number is 3 times the other. That means, one number, the number is 3 times the other. So, means, let's suppose that one number is 1, the other number is 3. One number is 2, the other number is 6. That means, in this one number is so, let's do let one number be x. Now, let's do it smaller and larger number be y. So, difference between two numbers. If a smaller number x is larger number y, then the difference is over y minus x. Larger number minus smaller number equal to 26. We have the first equation. Then we have one number is, we have the equation according to that. One number is 3 times the other. Eight number is 3 times. So we have to one number is y is equal to 3 times the other. y equal to 3. Now we have x equal to 3 by the If you have a larger number for y, then we have to write it. If you have a number of x, then you write x equal to 3. But if you have a larger number of y, then you can write it. The reason is that our larger number is 3 times equal. If you have a number of 1, then you can write it. If you have a number of 1, then you can write it. If you have a number of 1, then you can write it. If you have a number of 2, then you can write it. So, if you look at the body, you can see which is the larger number. So, our second equation will be y is equal to 3x. This is our second equation. This value, we will just substitute this method. So, this is 3x minus x equal to 26. So, 2x is equal to 26. x is equal to 26 or 2. Cancel over our time by pass x is equal to 30. ये हमारे पास x का वैल्यू है। अब दोनों में से किसी को टिक करके हम y का वैल्यू आएंगे। तो लेट्स से बोल रहे हैं इसको सेकेंड इक्वेशन में टिक करते हैं। सो y is equal to three into thirty x का वैल्यू हमने यहाँ पर टिक कर दिया। सो y is equal to thirty into thirty nine by x। तो दो नंबर से हमारे पास आ गए thirty nine and thirty। अगर आप आप देखो लॉस्ट चेक करके देखना x 30 is not. So, if you have 39 minus 30, you will get 26. That means answer is correct. So, if you want to verify it, you will get 25. So, this was question number 3rd. First part of exercise 3.3. You have to answer your book out as soon. So, in case you have any doubts, please do write to us. And do subscribe us. And please do watch the next video for some more questions. Goodbye.